well, um, yeah, okay, this is great, um, does anyone want to switch places, I and mean, some sort of stop, this had to, I'm getting a bit lonely up here, have no fear, Charlotte is here, I'll come up there, okay, I'm coming up, I'll sit right next to you. <laughs> Let's have some company. <laughs> Don't forget me, guys. Let's get started on the road there, April. I need to get home fast. I need to make some food. Okay. Not gonna ask about that. Where? Turn on the news. Okay, okay. Well, folks, as you know, Bill and Truman got impeached. He got impeached. The investigation originally started because he was suspected for cheating in the 2017 election. He is officially the third president in United States history to get impeached. Today we have a special guest. The special guest is Barbara Millicent Roberts. Miss Roberts will be telling us her opinion about the MP. Miss Roberts? Um, well, as you know, I believe in fair trial for all. And President Truman really showed his job to us. He says that this process is absolutely absurd and is crazy considering that he's innocent. Um, of course, I was in the courtroom when this happened, and I'm not allowed to tell the general public details. But I can say this. He had very, very, very vague he really didn't have a good alibi, and there was just a lot of evidence to prove it. Wow, who knew the political standby was so bad? President Truman has hurt just so many people and has been in so many lawsuits. He has been on national TV before. We can't let TV critics be president. This is absolutely horrible and he should not be doing this. So, um, of course I can say all these things and all these things are not my opinion. Everything I have said has been gathered and proven. I'm going to turn off the news. It's just really, really changing my decision and trying to force a decision. I agree the president has done some pretty bad things, but we can't just call him a bad person. Everyone deserves a second chance. Really, April, that's kind of annoying. Well, Let's forget about politics for a bit, because we're home. So home, sweet home. Guys, look at all that litter all over our community. It's just horrible and absolutely disgusting. <laughs> yes. It is absolutely the opposite of a fashion statement. I say we spend the rest of the day helping the community clean up. Yes, 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 I agree it's dirty, but I don't want to do the cleaning up part. Our school says we should be leaders, and we should. Well, what are we waiting for? A few hours later, I think that some of the last pieces of trash, guys. We did a great job. And just a word for some of our viewers. 
Remember, no matter who you are, how young or old, you can always make an impact in the community. Today, me and my friends helped clean up. And it's not just that. Now, I'm not saying you should go out and do this all by yourself. Of course, it is very dangerous out there. So be careful and take precautions. Always have someone you trust to be with you. And of course, don't forget to wear gloves. It's really, just really important. Yeah, thanks for that, Phoebe. That was really nice. Yeah. And I think it's just really great to think that no matter how old, how young, you can still help out in your community. Make a difference today. Well, thanks for watching. Bye, guys!